What's up everybody, it's your boy Duty back again with another video and this time we're taking a look at our boy Phil's daily rap video after an extended night of playing Zelda. Oh my lord, our boy Phil decided he was going to be done and over with Zelda no matter what and actually stayed about an hour and a half uh, longer than his uh, normal time and he was pretty annoyed about that. But of course he needed to beat the final boss which was pretty hilarious it only took him about an hour and 15 minutes to figure it out and actually beat the boss and as he said uh during that video he was pretty upset because he said what's the point of playing you know going an extended playing longer if i'm not going to be rewarded and he wasn't rewarded uh he got 16 dollars in tips for that playthrough and you know he was not a happy camper so let's see what Phil has to say on the daily wrap. A three, a day that ended up going extra long inadvertently. Let's talk about what happened today. So today we went back to full-time streaming. The first stream today was the Level 1 Podcast, which was a chill podcast. A lot of fun stuff to talk about, including some game news. Followed by Street Fighter 6, and I returned to using Marisa in ranked multiplayer for the first time in, I checked, over two weeks. In fact, it was almost three freaking weeks since I had used her, which I didn't realize it had been so long. Um, I learned some tech by watching videos, and I tried to apply it to my game. I did. Thing is, at this point, so many people have been playing Street Fighter 6 pretty hardcore that a lot of people kind of know how to beat Marisa. And Oh, Jasper, careful. He slipped. And, uh, you know, we got to a point where I was I was win winning, but I was losing a ton. Was okay, straight up there, Jasper did not slip. Jasper, Jasper was trying to claw fill. And what he was probably doing was he was probably trying to get at his phone to see it, you know, to show everyone if Phil's playing WWE Champions or not. So big ups to Jasper, the number one detractor. Keep 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 doing the Lord's work. And as it comes to Street Fighter, oh my lord, I don't know if you guys watched my playthrough or anyone's playthrough. He played Marisa with Marisa today on Street Fighter on the first edition, and it was just god tier terrible. It was bad. He lost a ton. And he was just raging. Apparently, he has this boner, uh, boner for for Ken. And uh, anytime he plays a Ken fighter, he just straight up gives up and doesn't even try. And of course, rage is like a madman uh, about it. And the other thing was support was pretty crappy for a Street Fighter. And of course, Phil made sure everyone knew that. So um, we may start seeing the uh, the scaling back of Street Fighter. Of course, Phil is going to start pointing out uh, more of the flaws of the game, especially as the uh, support starts to dwindle. Game Trekker, you need to step up. That $30 a day for Street Fighter is just not cutting it, B. You need, to, you need to step up. I was getting kind of frustrated. You know, there's certain things in this game that still frustrate me. I still think Ken is way overpowered and stuff like that. Um, I was, I was actually getting win streaks, and then all of a sudden I went on like a losing streak. In reality, I feel like I lost way more than I won. I really do. And I got a lot of rage, because there was things where I thought I should have been winning matches, and I was dropping inputs constantly. And again, I I swear to God, there were times when I literally am walking up, let's throw, and you, you would hear me clicking, pushing the buttons, and Marisa would just stand there like this. I do nothing. And I'm like, well, is it the game? Is it the online connection of the game? Is it my joystick? I mean... Am I imagining things? Did you not hear the click on the stream? And people were like, no, we heard you press the button. So it's like, I, I really don't know. I definitely think today I had the most dropped inputs and issues with missing moves than ever. There were entire matches I had won. And then right in the middle of the combo, move doesn't come out, and now I lose. And it seems like that's the thing with Marisa. She's really reliant on getting that one hit into a big combo for giant damage. And then if you don't get that hit and you don't get that opportunity and you drop it, you're pretty screwed. All right, so it was really frustrating. I'm trying to get better with these characters. And honestly, after having played Marisa today, I get the feeling she's not going to be top tier overall in the game. I think she'll be maybe mid tier, but she just seems like she's too reliant on getting one mistake punish into a giant combo. Um, as opposed to other characters who can constantly be on the offense and doing things with rushdown, she can't do that. So I, I, I like the character, but honestly, after today, I kind of fell a little bit less in love with her build. And I don't know if I'll go back to play here in the future or not. Maybe I will, but I'm like in no, no rush. You know what I mean? So overall, I don't even know how I did. I lost count of wins and losses. Uh, I'm sure I'll probably know for you guys either tomorrow or Wednesday because people are counting. But I get the feeling that I lost way more than I won. Even 
Yes, as someone who uh, painfully watched those streams, yes, you lost way more. Uh, I think you lost probably uh, two out of every three matches, not rounds, matches. Uh, it, it was pretty bad, Phil. You were pretty terrible. And I love how now you, you know, you, you loved Marcia initially, or Marzia, whatever. But of course, you know, when you have a bad day, uh, meaning tips, tips were very slow. Uh, he barely made the tier one tip goal. He received two tips, uh, 20 bucks from one minute man and 30 bucks from game tracker and then one other tip. So of course, whenever the, uh, liquidity, the positivity is slow, of course, Phil needs to highlight all of the problems that occurred, you know, during his Street Fighter. And, uh, you know, the g game's getting a bit long-winded. I mean, he's been playing it for over a month. And um, for the most part, support's been okay. I mean, he's gotten on most streams at least 100 bucks in tips. Um, and it's his most consistent game that he's playing as a release to support. But recently, it's been dwindling a little bit. This is, I think, the second in a row that he, he didn't do good. I think he, he ended up with 52 bucks a day. And then the last time he played it, I think he made 70 bucks. So of course for Phil, you know, he definitely needs those tips. And being that only two people, two or three people are stepping up and providing support, positivity, uh, mainly Game Trekker. Game Trekker has been kind of holding down Street Fighter for, for several weeks already. Uh, but eventually he's gonna go bored of it. Um, you know, he's gonna see his bank account has been, you know, fit, uh, pilfered essentially just giving $36 donations to this, you know, man child. And he's going to stop and then he'll come back later on. Very similar to Jack Raxter. You know, Jack Raxter used to always do the Friday night fights. And then eventually when the money ran out of his bank account or, you know, the, the check dried up, the disability check dried up, he left. So I envision the same thing happening with our good old boy Game Trekker. Even though it's funny because I leveled her up, she started at like, I think she was like one star or two star platinum. And she, by the time we were done, we were midway through three star platinum. What do you think about that, Jasper? Very. Um, but I don't know. I actually don't know where, where uh, you know, how many I won or lost, but it was frustrating and there was a lot of rage. Check out the videos. Uh, I'll, I'll think about using her again. I'm not sure. I'd like your feedback. Leave, the video, leave comments on the videos. Let me know what you think. Uh, tonight's late stream was Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And we were in the midst of the final dungeon, which we ended up completing within 45 minutes, way faster than I had anticipated because people were like, oh, this dungeon's tough and everything. I ended up turboing right through it. I did the two big puzzles I had left. We went right to the end area. The final boss was literally a joke pushover and I beat it within like two minutes. And I was like, I don't know what was so supposed to be so hard about that. So then we had to go to fight Ganon. And people were absolutely right. The trek to Ganon was a pain in the ass. But when you get to him, now, is he a standard boss? No, this is a Zelda game, and it's a Nintendo game, and of course, it's the latest one. They gotta go all out. Four phases to the final boss, all right? And the thing was, you know, I gave it one or two tries before I would have normally adjourned my stream. And we were there at the end of when I normally should have ended my stream, and basically, like, people are like, dude, you're at the end, this is the final boss. And I was like, yeah, but, dude, I knew it was gonna happen. I knew that I was gonna get locked into this insanely long Nintendo style final boss and it was gonna take all night, and it did. So instead of ending around 9.15 like I usually do, it's literally 10.36 right now and I'm still filming on a night when I would like to spend time with my wife. She has to work tomorrow, she has to get up early, and now I don't get to. But, you know what? I beat it, so I guess there's that. Um, how was the ending? It was all right. It was kind of a joke. I made fun of some of the stuff. Um, I'm not saying the final boss fight was bad, but it was annoying. There's parts of this fight where Ganon, every time he touches you, hits you with the gloom and you can't heal your hearts. So if you don't have any gloom restoring healing food, you're done. So I did, like, like basically I was getting through multiple phases, then, oh, I have no healing items, so I gotta start over. So I had to do it like two to three, I think it was like four times before I finally started perfecting the first and second phase, and then I got through it easily. So pretty annoying, honestly, but I got through it, and that was the end of the playthrough. And overall, I think you guys already know my thoughts on this game. Um, I wasn't in love with it, but I didn't hate it. There were parts I really liked. Like, every major dungeon was good. All of the major boss fights were pretty good. Actually, that last boss fight, not Ganondorf, but the one before it, the robot construct or whatever, that one sucked. That was actually a really shitty boss fight compared to the rest of the game. Um, <clears throat> but overall, I really liked it. And what's funny about it is, I didn't really upgrade my armor. I didn't have 500 
uh, gloom healing items, all the things people say you need that to beat the game. I didn't need you any of that shit. I just, I beat it. It's you know what I mean, like it, it, all the stuff that oh you need to spend 50 extra hours for freaking what? What did I really need? Did I really need the best armor, upgraded armor, doom resistant armor, do a, a million side quest lines? Why? The ending's the same. Right? It's the same fucking games and, it, you know, it doesn't change the outcome of the games who have done the 50 extra hours. Bill was just simply salty and sad that he went and he, he did an extended stream of over an hour and 30 minutes. And of course, he wasn't rewarded. And if you watch my video on the playthrough, he specifically said that. He said, What's the point of me going, uh, you know, playing my play, extending, going long, going overtime if I'm not going to be rewarded? And again, he only made $16 in tips. And that's why he's infuriated. That's why he's pissed off. Not because the boss wasn't good. Not because the game wasn't good. It's simply yet again because the tips were just not there. The support for the streams were not there from the very beginning. His first stream he made good, but everything after that was just garbage and support and of course like i always say bill simply gauges these streams by how much money he can make on the entire playthrough he has this mindset where if he doesn't get a certain level of support for a certain period like a grand total he thinks it's an abject failure and he moans and pisses and he's beat and he treats his, his viewers like crap and that's what he did all day today street fighter 52 bucks treated everyone like crap had to actually apologize for treating people like crap zelda 16 bucks same thing had the crap all over zelda and that's just phil's mo he's never gonna change and it's just more proof that that's who he is i've already talked about the, to this game so i was blue in the face so i'm not gonna sit here what i will do is in my year-end countdowns i will talk about this game and you'll know my true thoughts about it by the end of the year but I still enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun with the game. I'm glad I played it. I wish it didn't take two months to beat. I'm happy it's beat because now we can move on and do other things. I'm pleased uh, with that thought that we can now move on and do other things instead of having this lingering Zelda playthrough. That's why I kind of stuck around tonight to do it despite the fact that I much would have rather been spending time with my wife and we easily could have beat it Wednesday night. People wanted me to beat it, so I got it done. All right? So watch the end of Zelda. Enjoy. If you feel so much as to support it, that would be great. Um... Particularly today, tips were slow. Everything else was actually good. We actually had a good amount of members of Super Chats, but for some reason today, tips were slow. I don't know. Overall, it's not that bad, and uh, I'm just glad Zelda's done. All right? So tomorrow is Tuesday, and Tuesday, we're swapping games. So it's going to be Final Fantasy 16 on the first stream, and it's going to be the World Tour mode of Street Fighter Six on the late stream, <clears throat> where we're actually going to do that single-player content and try to level up my avatar. We'll see how that goes. I'm gonna tell you right now it's gonna go it's not gonna go well whatsoever that world tour thing he tried it once and it was just an abject failure it's boring no one supports it so that's not gonna be great and then he's gonna play final fantasy and we know how final set final final fantasy has been going if brianna one of the dents doesn't pop up and drop a dono he'll be he'll be lucky to make 30 dollars on that stream so expect him to bitch and complain about final fantasy now that zelda's gone He'll bitch and complain about Final Fantasy to the nth degree. So enjoy that dense. Enjoy enjoy that uh, wonderful playthrough tomorrow. It should be lots of fun. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace out.